Hey everyone, First Melagod here, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another exciting commentary rant episode topic, uh, thingamajig. Uh, I got a new mic, you can probably hear it right now, it's a Trust Stars microphone. Yeah, about the time I got a new mic, I even built the laptop one is, well, meh. Okay, so anyway, today's little commentary rant is gonna be about giving you some YouTube tips from me. So if you're just starting out, or you know, if you are a YouTuber and everything else, you know, just um, hear me out with uh, some tips I got for you. You know, these especially go for like new people joining YouTube, all that stuff. But anyway, keep listening, keep watching, and add your own down below in the comment section, of course. Okay, so the first tip is to be mature. Be an appropriate age, maybe saying 15 plus, to join, first of all, okay? Because uh, if you're making videos and thinking and you're like, what, 8, 12, whatever, squeaky voice, you know, your voice hasn't broken through yet, uh, your balls haven't dropped, all that stuff, no one wants to really hear, Hey, yo guys, this is X1X speaking. No one wants to hear that stuff, it just pisses people off, to be honest. No offense, kids. <laughs> Stay in school. Don't do drugs. Yet. What? What was that? Nothing. Sorry. Oh, cool. <laughs> oh, cool. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. Okay, so my next tip is to be don't do videos on games that are overplayed. For example, Call of Duty on Minecraft. Um, sure, these games may be fun, they may be good, you may enjoy them and all that stuff, but don't do like you know too many videos on them because there's so many channels on YouTube full of Minecraft let's build this, let's do that Harvest Time and all that stuff uh, Call of Duty that's 360 scope Road to Prestige and how many kills can I get in this map all that stuff you know don't overdo it on those videos uh, those games those videos because there's loads of content those of other YouTubers out there with a lot of it it's just spammed everywhere <laughs> Just type in Call of Duty. You'll find a lot. Don't worry about that. Okay. Next tip. Make sure you don't post more than at least three videos a day. Because it fills up your sub boxes. You know, everyone has subscribed to you. All that stuff. You know, just video after video, video. And even sometimes, you know, the sub boxes are broken. So they won't see them anyway. But uh, if they get like loads of videos in one day, you'll be like, ah, uh, this is too much, I'm not going to watch them all. So they probably won't even view one or all of them. You know what I mean. Okay, so another tip is to make sure you have cash to support your YouTube in for like uh, higher quality videos, better sound, microphone, and all that stuff, uh, other games, higher quality PC, render more. Uh, how your graphics, you know, all the graphics card, all the capture card, all all that stuff. It costs a lot of money. Make sure you do have some. Make sure you get a job because, yeah, it, does, it will cost you. Okay, so, my next tip would be to make sure you bring a variety of content. Or choose something you are happy with and stick with it. Because that's how you're going to get far, by doing something you enjoy. And um, if you bring a variety of content, it's just you know, makes everything much better for you. You'll grow a even bigger, wider, variety audience of stuff. Like you could have like people watching your commentaries. You could have people watching just these gameplay walkthroughs. You could have them um, watching uh, random videos. I don't know what it is. You know, all that stuff. Just keep it up with variety every now and then, or um, just stick with something that you enjoy playing or doing. And um, yeah, should be fine there. Okay, so another tip would be don't go spamming. Don't say first. Don't say, oh, hey, okay, could you please check out my channel? Because everyone will more or less mark it as spam. And they won't do it, you know. I've checked out channels and I've been like, eh. You know, no offense. But uh, you know how it goes. People spamming, oh, check out this website. Check out this. I'll grow my subs like this. No, that's spam. Don't don't bother doing it. You know, people will visit your channel for it and block you and all that stuff, flag down your comments and everything else. You know, report you all that stuff. So, no point in going spamming around. 
Okay, so my next tip would be to make sure you PM personal message some channels, you know, talk to them and everything else, talk to other YouTubers that you enjoy, you like, you watch and all that and um, just help each other grow, you know, be friends, grow both your channels equally and uh, fairly. You know, do do comms with each other, interact with each other and all that stuff, just, you know, enjoy it, grow each other's channels, all that stuff, that's what happens from being friends with other YouTubers. You know, we can have a much more fun, better experience with other people. Okay, so another tip would be that you should check your analytics often because you never know you know what your viewing base would be on this day, what's your worst day of the week unless you check I'm like you could be like um oh I haven't got no viewers in this video. Yeah, check your analytics, see what's the best day of the week and all that people have been viewing, the best date and all that stuff. And then uh just post the video then on that date, say like um no one watches a video on Wednesday. So then um check your settings, analytics. It says and a lot of views I gone up from Friday to Saturday, Sunday, so I'll post a video then saying I'll get views and all that. You know, just check them often, check your audience retention, see when uh, people are clicking off, not interested, and when they're clicking off uh, annotations and everything else, so then you can, you know, build that up, make it even more better, so then people stay for longer. So my next one would be quality. It should be decent enough, at least, you know. Nothing filmed off the potato camera 150. Nothing like that. Potato, you, potato microwave, like whatever you want to call them. You know, decent enough so people can see what's going on. Everything else, I I find decent enough, like uh, 240 up. 144 is like an eh. 240 is like eh. 360 is good. All the red. All the rest are all, you know, good as well, you know. So, yep, quality should be decent enough, at least. I should be numbering these, should I, or something like that, but I'll probably number them down below in this video. Oh, yeah. In the description. Okay, so my next one would be... Do not be afraid of horrible comments and dislikes on your videos. Because if you're getting dislikes on your videos, it's still going to be like promoting your video, people are going to be watching, still commenting and all that. You know, it's, at least it's getting seen if people are like commenting horrible stuff, you can easily block them, you can easily uh, thumb them down, all that stuff. You know, remove their comment, you know, don't interact with them if you can't handle it, you know. Uh, most people say you have to have a thick skin for all this, for all the comments you get and everything, but it's, you know, it's the internet, you're obviously going to get some hate every once in a while if you can't handle it then you know remove it or do or whatever you want to do you know it's up to you okay so another great tip for you if you're just starting off on YouTube and all that stuff is to be not doing it for the fame and money if you are then please just fuck off because lots of people come on you and they're just like oh yeah if I Post a video with yeah, hundred thousand views. I'll get YouTube monies, which is like a million dollars, and then I will get fame, and everyone will know who I am, and all that stuff. Yeah, it rarely ever happens. Sorry about that. That's the damn truth. Don't do it for the fame and YouTube money because it will not always happen. Only some people are lucky will get all that stuff. Okay, so another tip would be to have like a good personality, stand out from the crowd, all that stuff, to get people interested in uh, you, yourself, um, your stories, and uh, your channel content, and everything else from you, really. To have a good personality if you stand out more. More people are going to notice that, and yeah, they're going to stay on to you, subscribe, etc. Of course, another good tip would be not to worry about if I. If like um your subs aren't watching or anything else, your videos it could be they they just like um they sub for sub do something like that. You know that means they won't watch your videos really. They just want an extra subscriber and all that stuff. Um, or you know it could be you know sub box is broken. It happens all the time on YouTube. It's fucking shitty since Google took over it and 
making all these fucking changes that aren't even needing changes. Fucking cunts. Um. Lastly, last great tip I have for you is to enjoy yourself. You know, and if you do get stressed, burned out, or anything, don't know what to do video-wise, then don't be afraid to take a break away from it. You know, away from YouTube and away from you making videos. Just go on a nice little break. You know, recharge your batteries, watch other people's content, everything else. You know, and um, yeah, those are some YouTube tips from me. Um, that's all I have from you. Provide you with a uh, few there. Um, hope you enjoyed that. Of course, if you did, give it a like. Uh, just a like if you didn't like it. Comment down below your YouTube tips if you have any. If you liked my tips. Um, comment on the video. I don't know what the video is. Hope you liked my new mic, Trust Stars Microphone. Order it off Amazon UK. You can get it there today if you want one like this. Um, yeah. I've been First Metal God. You've been awesome as always. Thank you for watching, lovely gods and goddesses. I hope you have a lovely day. This has been First Metal God's YouTube Tips. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching and listening. Take care and goodbye.